idea to start with from the first but, but, but anyway now everything is in place and I just put it back on for a final check of, of um, alignment and fit I'm just going to do the tap test here first before taking it off dead solid the little if you heard the little high pitch noise it's it's coming from the back here from a plate hanging down so now we're gonna look at the print okay so here is the print and this is the plate that yeah, there is dead solid uh, yeah, and as you can see, it's still thankfully printed nicely. I'll have a look at it and see if I need to do some small touch up, but it looks it looks roughly okay. Yeah, continue the same. As I always say, it's very important to read the negative print also. Let's have a look at it, and it's. It's nice if we get the right angle here, we can actually see the oil groove printed off in the blue. Let's take a little picture of it here as well. It's difficult to catch the right. And this is of course also important to see it because it means you had a nice contact and didn't rub it off but lift it off. Hello, welcome back. Final fitting of the saddle. Clamps are being mounted and time to check the final clearance. Oh, you can hold it. Let me see this one. So, and then I grab it and we we'll lift it.
can do it and we see it's about one hundredth of a millimeter clearance. We move to the other side. And we lift. <clears throat> and it's a hundredth of a millimeter clearance. This is very okay. cross line on en droppe der en droppe der så går det da veva igjen en der og en der borte så kommer der eller der sånn det ser bra ut kanskje ikke rørdragningen men annars så ok så har jeg fittet the holding brackets for the saddle and uh, they have to have some gap otherwise it will bind of course I think I got it pretty okay it's about one hundredth of a millimeter on that side let's look at the other side okay so we are on the other side and there we go It's actually like two, but it's okay. <laughs> 